We're calling this Scary Saturdays. Alex, what are Scary Saturdays? Well, Scary Saturdays are an opportunity for yours truly to marry together two of my favorite pastimes, and that would be video games and being scared. Except I hate being scared. So, why am I doing this? A couple years ago, two of my friends, Ben Lee and Kevin Frisky, played some scary video games with me in my basement. The only reason we were able to complete them, I feel, was because there were other people with me. So, I'm trying to replicate that experience. I don't know if it'll be successful, because I'm talking to a camera. There's no one here in the room with me. The lights are out. It's dark. It's late. I'm probably going to get scared anyway. But, my hope is that I can actually finish this game by broadcasting it and, and letting other people see it. And maybe you'll have some uh, uh, enjoyment of me getting scared along the way. So that's what's going on. The game is Resident Evil 7. If you're not familiar with the franchise, it's a survival horror video game franchise. And this is number 7. It's technically the latest in the timeline, I guess, in the, in the core series. I don't know how that works. But what's different about Resident Evil 7 compared to other Resident Evil games is that this is first person. Uh, previously it's been third person, uh, as far as the core games go. So this is a lot scarier because you got the horror right there in your face. I started playing this game a year, maybe a year and a half ago, and I stopped at the beginning because, well, you'll start to see. So I'm in a house and I think I'm searching for my daughter or my girlfriend who's been lost. And there was this, this segment where I had to go into the kitchen and find an object or something. And as I turned to go back where I came from through the hallway, a silhouette of a woman passed by. And I got so scared that I stopped playing the game and I have not picked it up since until right now. So we're diving back in, and I don't know what to expect. So let's go on for a little journey together. Okay. Oh my gosh. Okay, so it did not save when I went to the kitchen, because I think you save by these little funky... Um, Looks like a cassette player. Looks like I have, a, I have a hatchet. I don't remember that. Got a nice little silhouette of a shadow. My shadow. Let me just get reoriented with the controls here. That's going to come in handy. That's going to come in handy too. <laughs> Every game is, of course, different in how they map controls and such, so got to go through that little process whenever you start a new game or revisit an old game. Man, I don't even remember what I'm supposed to be doing right now. Over 20, missing two years, so it's probably my girlfriend or my wife. Wait, what was in there? Okay, just your casual dead raven. I'm supposed to be doing right now. Okay, let's see here. 
head to the attic. Didn't I do that? Okay, so that's a third floor. Okay, so that's where I started. That was a save point. I don't understand how to get there. Looks like I have to go through the living room. Is that right? Looks like it's connected to another part of the house. Okay. I'll try going through the living room. I'm pretty sure everyone can hear the other random noises that are going on in this house and it's not making me feel very positive at all. So we're going to turn away slowly. Or drawbridge. I'm not talking. Maybe there's another set of stairs up here. Freak was that. Okay. Alright, we're just gonna have to go through the house. Come along. That's where we need to go. Wait, seriously? if it wasn't a smart move. I should probably mention that I was attacked by someone uh, earlier, uh, last time I played the game. So there's definitely someone around here that's probably just itching to come out and scare me, as if I need that extra scare factor. I feel like this is where we need to go, but it's locked. do that. <sighs> okay, so restore power to the stairs, that's probably what I need to do for the attic on that second level where it was. That's probably what it is.
Okay. Just your casual static playing TV. Just my casual shadow. I'm just casually scared. Okay. If I remember correctly, a year and a half ago, I think the switch to turn on the powers over here, and my gosh. That's... Please tell me that's my own movement. Oh, gosh. The funny thing is, is that this game is probably scripted to scare me at certain points, and yet here I am, like, walking around gingerly as if I'm about to awake someone I'm trying not to. switch somewhere around here. Light bulb works there. Oh my gosh. Switch, switch, where's the switch? The rest of the attic, okay, now I know where we need to go. Ready to be scared because I just did something, that's how scary games work. Oh my gosh! It's okay. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh my gosh, dude. Dude, 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 dude. Dude. Oh, I've been doing this wrong. I'm pressing the wrong button. Yeah, I think I'm dead. Stop the bleeding or something? Wait, I seriously have one arm? What? Where's my freaking inventory here? Do I have a bandage? Can I make a tourniquet or something? Bolt cutters. What the heck, dude? What the heck? Okay, so she went this way. If she's up here, dude... Gonna, if I get scared by my own shit, I'm gonna back into a corner. How do I just have one hand? Slash arm right now. I don't understand. This game's logic. Okay. 
Boy, does that freak me out, though. Oh my gosh. I'm just... I look, should I save right now? I feel like I'm mortally wounded. So if I die... You know, at least now I know what to do for the second... Second turn around. So the thing about Resident Evil games is that handgun ammo or ammo in general is usually hard to f come by. So I'm going to stick with the axe for now. Okay, first thing that's going to go, you're going to go. You're going to go. No creepy mannequins, please. How's this guy loading ammo into his gun, by the way? I only have one arm, in case you haven't seen Head to the... Wasn't I just in the attic? Do I have to go back up there? Oh my gosh! Something's coming! Oh my gosh! Head me back down! I didn't mean it, I swear! Whatever it did, I'm running! Running, 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 running! Okay, now I'm shooting, 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 shooting. Where the freak is the door? Okay, run, 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 run. Nice knowing you. Have a nice life. Oh my, what the, what the?